The oceans cover 70% of the Earth's surface, but we've mapped less than 20% of the seabed. But now, to help meet one of the UN's sustainable development goals to ensure the health of the world's oceans, JEBCO, a group of leading scientists, along with the Nippon Foundation, have teamed up to do what's never been attempted before. The goal of this project is to give us a comprehensive and complete map of the ocean floor by 2030. We know the surface of the Moon and Mars much better than we know our own seas. And the aim of the project is to change that. The minute we have a full and comprehensive map of the seafloor, we'll understand our planet Earth much better. Seabed mapping is vital for the security, safety and economic health of the world. The blue economy is valued at $1.5 trillion a year and supports around 31 million jobs. If we understand our ocean flows better, we understand marine habitat, we understand fisheries and their management. Three billion people rely on fish as a source of protein. The shape of the seabed is critical to understanding ocean circulation patterns, tides, wave action, sediment transport, tsunami wave propagation, underwater geohazards and resource exploration. With 1.1 million kilometers of submarine cable, we're also starting to use our ocean floors to stay wired and globally connected. It could take one ship equipped with a modern multi-beam echo sounder around 350 years at a cost approaching $3 billion to map the ocean floor deeper than 200 meters. So this project is taking a different approach. The idea behind crowdsourcing is to leverage the assets that are already at sea. Seabed 2030 doesn't have to put out ships every day to map the ocean floor. If you look over my shoulder, there's fishing boats. And if these fishing boats, and there's more than a million of them, are equipped with sonar equipment, they can contribute data to us. So fishing boat captains can contribute data. If you're a container ship company, we can do with your data. If you're a cruise line operator, then we can use your data. The project is already partnering with Fugro, one of the world's leading offshore survey companies and the organization that led the first search for missing Malaysia Airlines flight MH370. Most of the business that we do is tied to the oceans and uh, getting actively involved uh, into the uh, Seabed 2030 project was an easy choice for Fugro. With 17 deep water survey vessels working across the globe, we knew that we could uh, make a substantive impact. We used uh, the data of four vessels transiting from one project to the other, capturing data more than 100,000 square kilometers of high-resolution bathymetry data. Fugro's office-assisted remote services system enables staff working in centralized command centers to perform offshore survey tasks as if they were on board. This innovative technology means the company can collect these in-transit datasets with minimal interruption to its normal operating procedures. And based on that success, we believe we can apply a force multiplier and use this to roll that out throughout the whole entire Fugro fleet. Fugro recently announced that we are investigating together with our customers how we can actually use their propriety data and share that with the scientific community to the benefit of the whole humankind. All of this is vital for the sake of science. It'll advance the cause of science in an exponential manner. Seabed 2030 is encouraging the entire marine community to support this important mission, which will help us to use the ocean more sustainably and undertake better scientific research for the benefit of everyone.